Mr. Speaker, according to the National Committee on Pay Equity, working women stand to lose $250,000 over the course of their careers because of unequal pay practices. While women's wages and educational achievements have been rising, there's still a sizable gap in the gender wage gap. This is a national disgrace. Unfortunately, last week's Supreme Court decision in Ledbetter v. Goodyear does little to achieve fairness for American workers. In a narrow 5-4 decision, the Supreme Court threw out the case, not because she wasn't being discriminated against, but because she filed her claim too late. This interpretation, which has been rejected by eight federal appeals courts and the EEOC, fails to realize that employees are discriminated against every time they receive a discriminatory paycheck. Congress needs to step in and stand up for ordinary people without delay. We should move quickly to pass Congresswoman Dolores Paycheck Protection Act that would provide remedies to women facing pay discrimination. Mr. Speaker, I don't want to live in an America where my daughter earns less than my son for doing the same job. With that, I yield back.